Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nicole, and on this channel, we talk about everything from bag reviews, product reviews, and so much more. So if you're new here, definitely consider subscribing. Let's go ahead and start with pouches because those are some of my favorite favorite items if you've known anything about my channel or my packing style in general I love to use pouches to organize my bag so I'm going to show you my high-end favorites and my low-end favorites so that way there is something for everyone so without further ado let's jump right in all right, let's start with high end. I have my bag here because the pouches that I'm gonna mention I'm actually using right now. And one of my favorite pouches ever to use in my bag is the Sam Cosmetic Pouch from MZ Wallace. This is a higher end bag, but here's what I love about it. It has this little handle here on the end. It has two sections for you to put all of your stuff that you need. Um, one right here and then one on the other side. These double zippers are made of plastic, but you have Italian leather details on the zipper pull, which I think is really pretty, and then their logo here on the other side. This bag has been released in so many fun colors seasonally, and I think it is absolutely one of my most used bags. Another honorable mention from MZ Wallace is their new release, which is the Bowery, this is the medium Bowery pouch. Um, I love it because it's soft, I like the Bowery material, but inside, it surprised me. So on the inside of the bag, there is a hidden zippered pocket. I have it opened up. So you have a little zipper pocket where you can put some valuables if you need. And then when you open it, you have a ton of space. So this is also released in a bunch of different colors. This has a gunmetal zipper and then the little leather zipper pull. Definitely on the higher end, but one that I have been loving this year. One more pouch I have to share from the high-end side is this one from Kuyana. This has been in my bag every single bag, I think, this year. It's a little leather pouch, and as I've used it, it's gotten soft and amazing. I just have some little odds and ends in there now, but it has a beautiful gold zipper made of metal, and I just think it's such a sweet little versatile bag, and they offer this in a bunch of different colors too. All right, let's jump into something that's a little bit more affordable. I love 12 Little. I love 12 Little. I think that the company is absolutely phenomenal. I think they make great bags and I think they make great pouches too. 12 Little's insulated pouch is one of my absolute favorites. It has a waterproof zipper and silver insulation right inside. It keeps your stuff hot or cold for hours on end and I think it is such a great size. It has a little wristlet here too. In addition to the insulated pouch, they also have a pouch trio. 40 bucks, you get three pouches, a big clear pouch, um, a medium sized pouch, and a small pouch. And I think it is such a great find if you're organizing diapers and wipes and things, or if you just are looking to organize your stuff in your purse too. So love, love, love 12 Little. I almost forgot one of my favorite pouch trios that I have ever used, and it is from Mina Bay. It's available in nylon, also in leather, and it comes in a set of three. This is the medium sized pouch, and this is kind of an idea of what I can hold inside of it. And then this is the large pouch. I love using the large pouch as a purse. It comes with a strap that you can attach, and I think it is just the perfect, perfect size. Look at everything I can fit inside. Seriously the best, so well made, and like I said, they're available in leather and in nylon. I've also mentioned before some pouches that you can find at Target, like this little one by the Post-it Company. This is perfect to hold snacks and all kinds of things, and I believe it's under $10. So definitely some awesome affordable options that you can find at Target too. Right now, um, one I've been loving that's brand new to me actually is this little neoprene Lego pouch. It's part of their collaboration with Lego. So if you're looking for a great affordable option, it can be just as easy as looking at your local Target. A couple of other fun pouch options that are a little less expensive are this silicone pouch from Oventure, also available in a bunch of different colors. It has a little ring right here so you can attach it to your key ring or to your bag or stroller. Um, and it's silicone, so it's waterproof, great to use during summertime or really any time of the year. And then lastly, I love to repurpose pouches for different things. And this Ultimate Planny Pack from Erin Condren I think would make a great activity case for your kiddos. It's available in a bunch of colors. Um, this is the rose gold, and on the inside, there's places for your pens and your pencils. You could also put some little mini play packs right in there. 
So I think this would be a great, also more affordable option as well. One more category I wanted to touch on right quick is these little teeny tiny pouches. These are my two favorites from the high end and the low end. MZ Wallace makes this adorable little metro pouch and it holds AirPods, hair ties, things of that nature that are smaller. And you can clip it onto a lot of their straps or onto the D-rings of your bag. And then 12 Little makes a pouch that is very similar. And I love it. I actually have a video on this little pouch, how you can use it 10 different ways. Um, but it looks like that and it comes in different patterns and it's adorable. So if you're looking for a cute, fun option with a little teeny tiny bag, these are my two faves. All right, those are my favorite pouches of the year. Of course, there were many other pouches that I've used throughout the year that I do love, but those, these are my top, top picks. I would love if you shared your favorite pouches with me in the comments down below because I'm always looking to try new things. And thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, give it a big thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see all of you guys again in my next one. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.